has a beautiful little baby and a fiance who maybe never got to say goodbye, never got to tell each other they love each other. He'll never get to hold that baby. Emotions running high in McKeesport and really throughout the Pittsburgh region. Friends, family and fellow officers preparing to lay officer Sean Slagansky to rest on Tuesday. The Baldwin Whitehall community also mourns his death. Officer Slagansky grew up in North Baldwin, making a name for himself on the hockey rink and in the halls of the school district. Megan Schiller joins us now from outside the funeral home with how the community is preparing to say an emotional farewell. Police officers have been here 24 seven with someone standing guard at Officer Sean Slugansky's body here at John F. Slater Funeral Home. We've watched as officers from different departments come here to change shifts, making sure they're here at all times to show support. Slugansky leaves behind his mother, his fiance and the couple's young daughter, along with his two older sisters and his two beloved dogs, Sig and Knox. Even though his law enforcement career brought him to McKeesport, the Baldwin graduate made a big impact in the Baldwin Whitehall community. His friends called him Slug for short, saying he had an amazing sense of humor and would have thought he looked sexy in the picture everyone's sharing of him. He loved being a police officer and loved his job, the happiest he's ever been, according to friends. Baldwin Superintendent Dr. Randall Lutz shared memories with me today of being first his neighbor in North Baldwin and then his middle school principal at Harrison. And Sean was class of 09. Uh, older sisters, a class of 04, class of 07. So just knowing all of them, and, and he's a neighborhood kid. So from where, where he lived growing up, uh, basically in North Baldwin, walking distance from where I live, it really hit close to home professionally, of course, but also personally. But he's just, you know, again, he's a neighborhood kid. I'm, I, I'm a North Baldwin kid all my life, and, and, uh, and knowing that he was as well. And the city of McKeesport Police Department just uploaded this photo to its social media accounts, a darkened flag with a pronounced thin blue line. The department's now draped in black wreaths and black and blue ribbons in Officer Slugansky's honor. And here in Baldwin Whitehall, Superintendent Lutz tells me that right now they're trying to plan a shuttle service. People that plan to come to the visitation can either park at the old Bowser car dealership or at South Hills Country Club, maybe even Baldwin High School, and get a shuttle here to Slater. They also say right now they're trying to figure out what they're going to do with school on Monday and Tuesday. So they say expect details to come out from the district soon. Reporting tonight in Brentwood, Megan Schiller, KDK News.